Cadazil is a small artery disease of the brain. Uh, Cadazil is an hereditary disorder. If the diagnosis has been made in one subject, the risk to have the gene in his or her children is about 50%. Cadazil is a disease of a smooth muscle cells within the wall of the small arteries penetrating the brain. Uh, the disease is responsible for different types of symptoms. Migraine with aura is one of these symptoms and uh, uh, is detected in about one third of subjects mainly between 20 and 40 years of age. Most patients, more than two-thirds of them, will present during their life uh, acute ischemic stroke, motor deficit, language disturbances of acute onset. They can be transient or uh, uh, can lead also for some uh, deficit. Uh, these uh, transient ischemic attacks or stroke are usually observed in the absence of vascular risk factors. Uh, after uh, years, uh, the uh, disease can be uh, responsible at the late stage of the disorder, usually uh, after uh, 60 years of age. Uh, the disease can be responsible for uh, gait disturbances, uh, balance troubles, and can lead progressively to uh, some cognitive impairment with memory deficits. And uh, sometimes it can lead to a very severe uh, clinical status uh, at the uh, really uh, late stage of the disorder. But we see also in the, uh, the uh, families affected by cadazil by that the expression of the disorder is extremely viable among individuals even in the same family with the same mutated gene. The diagnosis of cadazil is usually suspected after the discovery on uh, MRI of white matter hyperintensities in your in the brain. The presence of these white matter lesions does not significate that the disease is uh, severe and the extent of these white matter lesions is not related to the clinical severity in cadazil. The most severe lesions in uh, cadazil are lacunar infarctions uh, which are responsible for small holes visible on MRI. In uh, uh, presence of white matter lesions, the diagnosis of cadazil uh, cannot be confirmed only with the presence of uh, white matter lesions. You need for that a genetic test. And uh, this genetic test uh, shows a mutation in the Notch 3 uh, gene, and all mutations in cadazil should lead to an odd number of cysteine residues in the external part of the uh, notch 3 protein. This is very important and uh, you should check that the genetic test actually shows this mutation responsible for alterations of, of the number of cysteine residues to ensure that the diagnosis of cadazil is certain. The NOTCH3 gene and mutations in the NOTCH3 gene responsible for cadazil has been, have been discovered in 1996. Uh, today, we have uh, animal models of the disorder and uh, different preclinical pre studies are performed now on these animal models to search for a treatment. Uh, we are also now ready uh, because uh, for uh, doing a clinical uh, trial in this disorder, because we have accumulated uh, data during the last decade concerning the clinical course, the MRI lesions, and the um, predictors of clinical severity in the disorder.